it literally seems like you just have to say Sockany times and I'm interested. <laughs> What's good guys, Ash Bash back again with another sneaker review. And I wanna first off say shout out to all the old subscribers, all the new subscribers. Shout out to everyone that's commenting on the videos, especially my videos on Monday where I'm waffling on about a topic. So I've enjoyed uploading these for these like last eight weeks or whatever I've been doing it. Loads of interactions, which I've, what I want really. I wanna to chat to people on there, which is very good. So keep that up. If you're not um, subscribed already, hit the subscribe button. As I said, I upload every single Monday and sneaker reviews as and when I pick stuff up, which seems to be way too regular right now. But good for you, bad for my wallet. Anywho, let's talk about these kicks. So this pair right here, I actually found out about them on Instagram. It was either the IG page Sockany Sneaks or Sockany.collaborations. One of them posted like a little sneak peek at a sneaker that was coming out from Sockany. It was a collaboration with Feature. I've got a Feature collab before, which was the Barneys, I think they're called, which was super dope, super themed sneaker, and the box and everything was just super duper good. So I was already excited that it was a Sockany collab, especially with Feature, and it was like a sort of forest green kind of color. So I was like, yeah, I'm in, I'm in, I'm in. Then they eventually revealed the whole shoe, and I was like, yep, I want a piece of that, and now I've got a piece of that. So let's show you this sneaker and the box is fire as well. So this is the box right here, a lot going on. Probably wondering why it's like this, what is going on. Basically Feature is a sneaker boutique based out in Nevada. This is inspired by the Ichthyosaur, which is a Nevada state fossil, I believe it is. And it's inspired by the sort of color it is during its life and stuff. So you can see on the box here, you've got all these sort of patterns with the sort of bone prints from fossils and stuff like that. Very, very cool. It's got details on the back here about the name of the dinosaur, what kind of breed it is and all that. And it says handle with care. Loads of little fire bits on it. <clears throat> so it is a Sockany Shadow 6000, which is hands down in my top, I'd say top five for sure, favorite sneaker models and top three for comfort as well. And I've got it in a UK 10, which is my size for every Sockany, which fits me perfectly. So nothing to worry about that. And it says Sockany and feature on the box. Details, that's what we want. So let's open it up, see what's inside. Killing it already. It's got that sort of, um, the plastic thing you get with Jordan 11s, if you're a Jordan 11 owner, which I like. Annoying to use, but it's nice for protection and all that. And then this paper here. That's dope. It's got a picture of the Sockany, Sockany feature. Then here it's got a map of Nevada. What a nice touch. And loads of little dinosaur information as well. From the looks of it, that is fire. Holy sh... Wow. These are fire. I knew they were fire, but these are extra... Wow, okay. See, I'm not one to jump out the window and say a shoe is my favorite of the year, like straight away, but it's a candidate already. It's a serious candidate. Anywho, boom, here is the sneaker in all its glory. There is a lot going on. Oh gosh, this is fire. Anywho, enough of me waffling on and just being excited to show you some close ups and some details of this kick, which is just goddamn. So the shoe is pretty much all green, different shades of green. And the lateral side here going all the way around to the front, down to the medial side of the sneaker is basically in this super duper change color, buttery suede. And I just love the buttery suede. I did a video before saying, why do we love it? But we just do. It's nice that they put some quality into it. That's what I love about Sockany. They do reasonable prices and the quality is always A1, especially in collabs and especially feature collabs from the looks of it. But yeah, it's in this change color suede. I did read somewhere, I think it was on Hannon, they were saying that this suede is waterproof. I didn't know waterproof suede was a thing, maybe it is, but that's supposedly what it is. So all of these green hits is all in that lovely, lovely suede. The toe box here is a material that I don't know what it is. You can see some sort of lines in it. I don't know if that's Gore-Tex, which will make a bit of sense of the waterproofing thing. I'm not too familiar. I don't think I actually have any Gore-Tex on any sneakers I have to compare it. 
but I think it is. Hopefully that's 3M as well. I doubt it will be, but if it is, that would be insane. And towards the side of the shoe here, behind that shoe Sockany logo, is this crackled leather, obviously to represent the dinosaur skin from the Ichthyosaurus. I've got it written down there, something like that. And then you've got the Sockany logo in this darker green with some green hits in the little circles there. Very, very cool. And then towards the midsole, I think this is one of the most fire parts of the sneaker, oddly enough. Starts from black towards the front of the shoe, goes into this sort of mint green with some black speckles that it goes into this sort of off-white colour with more speckles. And obviously it says Sakoni hair, which you normally get with all these Sakoni sneakers. Back of the shoe, it's got this crazy green hit, which is in this sort of patterned leather piece here. It kind of looks like a bloody eyeball from Godzilla when he opens his eye at the end of the film. And also says Sokani stitched in hair. This side of the shoe, exactly the same. It comes with some rope laces, which is in this sort of lighter green colorway. And I did notice before, spare laces. It's all you can ask for in a collab, like it's the minimum you can ask for. And that is a pair of flat green and flat sort of beige, same color as the heel on this shoe. The midsole, shall I say, on this shoe as well. So nice touch but I'll probably leave the rope ones in for now. It has got these two little black stitching marks here on this side as well. I'm not sure if that is to represent teeth or something. I'm not too familiar with the dinosaur. I know that it's one of them sort of dinosaurs. It's not even a dinosaur. It's one of them ones in the water. If you've seen the new Jurassic Parks, that massive one that comes out of the water, I think it's that or something like that. So I don't know if it's to represent that or not. And I think that is it for details. Oh yeah, inside the shoe here. It looks like kind of like a dirt from where you pick up fossils and all that. Let's see if the other shoe has anything different. And it does. This one says feature inside it. And this one here has the old school Sockney logo. Yeah, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They killed this one. Hopefully it fits fine, which it should do because I've never had any trouble with Sockney. But I am excited. Let's chuck these on feet, Shay, what I like. There we go. Fit-wise, as I expect with all Sokanis, fit me totally perfect and totally comfortable. So yeah, nothing to worry about with that. What did you think of the on-foot look? I am digging it big time. Yeah, mate, this is this is top five, top three easily. I'm trying to think of what's come out and what I've copped, but I, off the top of my head, I can't think of anything that I'm putting above it. And the packaging as well, it just killed it. The only thing that comes close, probably beats it packaging wise, is the collab I did, they did with End and A6, the Wasabis, I got a review for that as well, which you can check on my channel. But yeah, man, this is fire. Collect these, pick these up if you can. They've got a worldwide release, I think it is this Friday or Saturday. I'll link to anywhere that's selling it in the description below, but yeah, check these out for sure. Super duper fire, super duper fire. Uh, oh yeah, the super duper fire. Anywho, this is the end of my video. Hopefully you've enjoyed. Follow me on Instagram, which is Ash Bash Sneakers, and my Twitter is Perfection Seven. I told you about when I upload my video, so you know what's good. Anywho, I'm out. Radio.